Chris. <laughs> A-Hole Productions. All right, testing one, two. Testing one, two. Go this way. Did we pick something up? Maybe we picked something up. There we go. Session illegible. Steady progress. The patient seems to open up more. Uh, once more, some time has passed from the event. Once more, time has passed from the event. The drawing facilitates memory re recollection. I was able to put together a rough timeline of events. The children leave the patient's house and enter the woods. The children. He finds a wounded animal in a snare. He is drawn to a disturbance. There is a man slash wild beast. Something happens. This is the repressed memory. The patient leaves the woods and is found by a truck driver. We'll slowly build up towards the repressed memories. Continue using behavioral methods. Consult with Dr. Smith about aggression as a symptom of anxiety and neurosis. See, I'm thinking they're describing me. I, you know, I, I'm thinking I'm the patient, not Carver. Um... That would make sense to me. Hey, what's up, lonely Sophia? Welcome, welcome. We are picking up right where we left off in the last episode. We are approaching the house. We watched the video called The Reveal. Um, we found a, a journal entry about, uh, you know, someone's... Uh, someone being diagnosed. Uh, I think it's us. I don't know. I have my theories. But, uh, oh my god, this house, seeing it, I remember, uh, how much of this house made an impact on me, and it made me appreciate the first Blair Witch more when the third Blair Witch came out, um, and it ends with them walking up to this house, and almost at an exact angle like this, and I was like, oh my god, <laughs> uh, okay, that place does scare the crap out of me, and so I was like, kudos to the first movie, um, for leaving that long-lasting impact. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna... I'm in no rush to go inside this freaking house. So I'm hoping there's like something outside I can... grab. I'm gonna pick up, but sadly not. How are you today, Lonely? Spooky! Oh, I know. So spooky. Okay. Here we go. Writing on the wall. I wonder if, uh, can I? I can't do the, uh, wow, it is pitch black in this house if you don't have this light. Uh, I, th I was hoping I could do like uh, night vision, but. No, no, no. Light. No going back, Ellis. There never was. What's. What's happening? Let's get this over with. Oh, what? Camera! Camera flashlight. Wow. Locked. Oh, Jesus. Won't budge. Oh, my goodness. So this is even creepier because you're all by yourself like uh in the other movies it's like a group of people that come in and you're just like no don't be stupid you know think you know act like a group and and uh try to overpower whatever it is but uh in this one you're, you're straight up by yourself man i shut the door yeah i just don't want anything coming up behind me <laughs> anything in here wow and these see, what I like about this is too it's not like Resident Evil or you know things like that where it's like all right you gotta you gotta pick this up there was that one area where we got stuck where we had to like find items to like make a machine work but and that it's it's not like oh go in this room and pick up this and get this key to do this and it's just like no nope, it's an old effing house and you're stuck in it and there's no map And you just gotta figure it out. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Oh shoot, what? Oh. That's a call back to earlier when uh, the kid, he was leaving the, the baseball to uh, follow him. Oh god. Oh my god, okay. Uh, let's just, let's examine. God, I'm I'm petrified, dude. And I know it's funny because like this game hasn't really had things jump out at us and scare us. Um, but you know, you never know, man. Like you never know how this game's gonna shake up. How are you today? Not feeling great, but I'm here. Thank you. What happened to Bullet? Um, well, Bullet is sadly no longer with us. Uh, unfortunately, it was a really sad scene. Um, yeah, it was really uh, it was bad. And I hope you feel better. I know the feeling. I feel okay today, so. I'm going to send my good vibes to you. Hopefully you feel better soon. Uh, last session with Patient. He is leaving Burkittsville. In his own words, he feels he is able to move on. I'm glad about this. Less glad about the how. He'll be enlisting in the military service as his father, a colonel, convinced him to join. Worried about what effect the environment will have on a sensitive psyche. The stress and trauma of active duty might completely displace his childhood trauma with the woods. The same trauma that he already seems to have forgotten. However, I'm afraid the woods will never leave him. No matter what occurs, it will remain beneath the formative experience that made him who he is today. You gotta be kidding me. I think I'm piecing this together. Maybe I'm reading too much into it. Are we also the child? Is the child's name not Peter whatever? Are we the kid? And we went through a traumatic event as a kid and then now we're grown up after the military? I mean, could that be three timelines? And then we're also Carver? Can that be three timelines converging here? That would be insane. Is this back to the stairs? Yeah, okay. Wow, this place sucks. Oh, the handprints on the walls. Dang, man, they got the details from the movie. Like, what? Thank you. I'm glad you're okay to take. Hey, thank you. Yeah, I'm doing all right today. No complaints. Um, sorry that you are are having trouble. Locked. There's got to be a key somewhere. All right, so we do got to find one key. Well, at least I know I explored everywhere down here. Now let's tighten up our sphincters and go upstairs. There was some, like, um, I think they addressed that in the third movie, how there was originally the kids that were put in the corner, they were all brought down to the basement. I think that was something they said in the first movie. Um, oh, there's sticks. Are we, can we not smash them anymore? Um... Oh, we can't go upstairs? Oh, nope. Doesn't look like it. I'm just not looking forward to walking into a room where someone's just standing in a corner. Um, but I think in the first movie there was like, all the kids went in the basement and stood in the corner. And then in the third movie they said, oh, there's some contention about that story. About whether it was the basement or the attic. Um, so that's fun that they're, like, making you go through the house and, like, you know. Um, they're like, oh, you could go upstairs or could go downstairs. But, yeah, it looks like we're going to end in the basement, though, which makes sense. You got to be kidding me. That's the key? Oh, God. All right, now what's going to happen? Now that we picked up the key, it's probably triggered some event. I kind of only want to move when the lightning strikes, because it just helps illuminate the place more. All right.
Where did he wipe his hand on the wall? Is it here? Um... That wall? It had to be that wall, right? Okay, I guess not. All right, here we go. Shut up. Okay, lonely, hold me. I don't know, seek a nice couch and maybe some pumpkins and the place would look great. Thank you, dude, you're sweet, you can do it, seek. Show the spookiest who's the boss. Well, it ain't me. I think the spooky is the boss. Wow, there's rooms down the here? Wait. How, how did I end up back here? Wait, I am, I'm not in the basement. I didn't do something. It was something on the tape. I'm telling you, I, I didn't do something. Or maybe I did. That's crazy, though, that they made me... See that door. Jesus. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, my God. That one was different. Well, I just made it angry. Oh, my God. I'm sorry if I scared you, lonely. <laughs> I'm so sorry for the uh, sudden. Increase in noise. Oh my god. Oh, f you fucking game. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Lonely, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to just scream in your ear. Uh, anyone else who's watching later on YouTube, I'm so sorry. Oh my god. Oh, no, not again. <sighs> Is this the... It's not the wall either. Oh my god, I shall hold you a heart attack. It's okay, not your fault. Oh my god, that really, that really got me. See my hands? They look like Carver's hands. Oh, shikes. Where'd that door come from? That wasn't here before. I don't 
like the way that branch is coming through the wall there. Running water? There's no way this place does running water. I mean, maybe it's hooked up to a well. Oh my god, the bed's gone, and now there's a hole in the wall. I can't. I have to stay crouched in here. Well, what is in here? Ah, there's something here. Oh, it's a tape. Jesus, no. That got me too? Oh, my, yeah. I'm sure my screen probably got you. The ruin. Whoa. stuff again. Let's say the door should be open now. <laughs> Peter. Great, we looped around again. Why is he sighing? <laughs> it's like, oh man, the door's locked. Good, screw that, I'm glad the door's locked. I don't want to go in every room here. Oh, shoot. What the? <laughs> wow. What's with all the symbols, man? I take it back. House is too spooky. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's effective because there's not a lot of rooms in this house. Uh, thank God I was talking because that would have got me. <laughs> um, there's not a lot of rooms in this house, but uh, but they're very good about um, reusing them um, in like new ways each time. That's which is fantastic. It's uh, working within your budget restraints, which is hey, what the hey, movies do. <laughs> What? What? That was the window that thing broke in. Whoa, the wallpaper. What? This is a new start for you, Alice. Gives you power, gives you a chance to hold life in your palm. You touch the twigs and run your fingers through their bones. You press them down, you break their spines. She watches you once you pick them up. She won't let you put them down, and her whispers become sweeter every time you clench your fist. Oh man, throughout the whole game, we were grabbing those sticks and destroying them. Should we have not destroyed them? <laughs> Is there an option to not destroy them? On you right now. This ain't good. The house is rebuilding into like what it used to look like. It takes some getting used to, but it can be done. Wow. How is Ellis just not? That's the thing about first-person games sometimes. Like, have the character say something right now. Have them go, like, what the F, you know? Like, more than once. Like, I know he kind of did a little bit earlier, but just, like, as he's walking through here, just like... Where's my light? Uh, 
I can see my, that's my feet. Oh, jeez. That's done. It's done. No point dwelling on the pass. What the heck? What? This is your chance to do something good, Ellis. Don't waste it. What is this? We're walking through some deep memories here, man. I was like, you know what, I'm going to just stand in this corner and do nothing. And, uh, oh man. You hear Ellis breathing? Wow. Why does the witch want us so badly? No happy ending. What does it say? You are for her? Oh, come the f on. What's in that bottle? Can I drink it? Because I kind of want to die right now. And I don't want it to be from the witch. Wow, this game. Something else, dude. I'm not, I'm not kidding, I'm, what? Okay. It's just too much, I can't take any more. I won't let you drag me down with you. I think we already read that before. Who are these people? Alan, Ashley, Doctor, Donnie's Pizza, Keith, Oliver. Could we have called those numbers throughout the whole game? Oh man, we probably missed a bunch of story elements. Whoa, here we go. What is that? Well, let me inspect it. Wait, that's my wallet. From the beginning of the game. Didn't we look at our own wallet like that? I don't love you anymore? Oh, man. Oh, I see. There's messages on the wall in the camera. I was like, where is he reading that from? Tighten your sphincters, everybody. Shit. <sighs> wow. Oh, that's the water effect. I'm like, what are, what's that mud coming down? Dude. Lonely. Come on, hold me. Spooky string instruments. Nope. Tell the musicians to practice elsewhere. Is that pizza time? I know, I should have, I should have ordered a pizza. Um, do you think, I'm like, hey, can you deliver it to the spooky house in the woods? They're like, uh, no. Yep, you don't have a choice but to destroy it. 
because I just tried a different button to put it away safely and it, it destroyed it also. And it won't let me inspect these anymore. Yeah, our hands are starting to look like Carver's hands. Wow. I think I do have to go through here, so let's try the door real quick. Just making sure there was not, nothing we had to go through. There's a truck out there. Anybody Turn on the lights. What? The headlights. What? Turn them on. See? It is us. seeing all the stuff that happened earlier in the game or or, or reliving the the proper memory for it or something what just uh all right that door opened i think What a creative, like, holy shit! Sheriff. Uh, but, like, you know, the movies, unfortunately, they never have the budget to do something like, like, rearranging the house, you know, like, I guess. And I love that. I love what's happening here with this house. They start out, like, that could be its almost its own Blair Witch movie of someone just still keeping it low budget, but just, you know, 20, 10, 20 minutes of them outside and then them finding the house pretty quickly and then moving through the house and learning all the secrets of the house. Um... And the house shifting like this, that would be awesome. Don't look, be aware. Careful. Are you a good man, Ellis? I'm starting to think I'm not, man. Ah, oh, Jesus. Now I'm starting to get the panic attacks. How do you imagine your future? I think I've been seeing my future this whole game, dude. Light awakes him.
And it is us. Look, we're like turning into a creature. How do I not look at him? Do I just go backwards? Oh, never mind. F found it. <laughs> it's the basement stairs. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. We made it down another floor. But it sounds like there's still more in here. He will stop when I give him a spanking. <laughs> Bummer seek. Sorry. Hey, it's okay. Game seems cool, but it also seems to have some frustrating moments. I mean, yeah, right. I guess rightly so. You don't want the game to be too easy, but. Um, but yeah, there's just a little. Sometimes it's like. I'm not a fan of trial and error learning. It does say follow the marks on the ground, but it, it also says the light, you know, pisses him off. So. I'm kind of like, well, I, I need the light to see the stuff on the ground. So I guess I guess it's a combination of everything. You can keep the light on as long as you look right at the, the muck on the ground that leads you. And as long as the light's not facing him. See, I just thought by having the light on, we would be dunzy. But that was just uh, me overthinking it. Shit. We gotta oh okay. We got a robbery keep following. in progress. A convenience store near Burkittsville Road. Those kids again? Yeah, probably. Whoa. Oh no. We're in the attic. No. Yay! What's up? What Cabareoville, what's up? How are you? Alright, we'll just follow this. Our flashlight went out. Of course it did. Thank goodness this is like an even stream of where to walk. Not like a before where it would just be like spots and you had to look for the next spot. Oh man, are we going back down? Ah! Oh, there, whoa. Oh, you're kidding me, you dear. Oh my. <clears throat> Do you copy, Alice? Over. Adam. Where? What the? Did you shoot anyone today? What? You ruined everything. Alice, answer me. Disappointing. 
Oh God. You there, Psycho? local teenager allegedly involved in a convenience store robbery was shot by a police officer arriving at the scene. The suspect was transported to a nearby hospital in critical condition. Local authorities confirm that the suspect was unarmed. 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 He had a it's, I guess he had a body cam on, or is this just showing a memory? Because, um, isn't doesn't this take place in the late '90s? Like, <clears throat> I don't know if they, I don't know. If, I mean, I'm I'm sure they had. I don't know. Maybe not a small town like Burkittsville might not have had body cams, but. Oh, what? I'm to blame for that. Dang, dude, you shot it's a kid. not where it all started, is it? What the f... God dang, man. Room. It's been like... Here comes our handsome laugh. Hey, is it true you shot the pretty face off of basic training? And what kind of girl would want you now? Hey, shh. he's coming. What the fuck? Whoa, is there like a team of Showing up on the thing. Come here, fuck face. Whoa. Sir! Sir! Yes, sir. What? Freaking butcher. Sir. Sir. Why did I hit him? Sir. 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 What the F did we do, man? Fuck. 
LOL fuckface. <laughs> I've only seen the first movie, it wasn't my sort of film. Oh, The Blair Witch Thing? Who else here is watching? What's up, everyone? I have never seen the original film. Anyone recommend? Um, yeah, I don't know if I'd recommend. I mean, I don't know. It's it's hard to say because it's definitely a product of its time. I feel like if you watch it now, you're you're gonna see like um, you're gonna be like, oh, this is a lot like this and this and and those things that you're gonna compare it to are things that the first Blair Witch kind of inspired in a way. Um, so it's it's probably gonna be weird to watch it. It'll probably come across very boring. Um, so I would say watch at your own risk. Um, the, if you do watch the first one, uh, there are only three movies. They're they're easy to find for really cheap. Jesus. Or if you want to rent them. Um, Monarch, this is Foxtrot 1. We confirmed enemy soldiers at 2 o'clock. They are unaware geez. of our presence. Out. Uh, oh, jeez. I would say this game's a little different than the movies, for sure. It does things that the movies just don't have the budget for. Uh, but, uh, but it does keep the spirit of the movies, I think, pretty well. Especially the first one and the third one. Um, the first one's called Blair Witch Project, second one is Blair Witch 2? I don't know what the project? I can't remember if they dropped the project or not. Um, and the third one is just called Blair Witch. We're starting to remember all of our, our war buddies. Jesus! Alan Sylvester, Ashley, all their names are written everywhere, huh? What's that say? Oliver. Whew. There go. Final descent into hell, probably. Initial investigation report, operation objective, status, and accomplished summary. Due to errors made during the reconnaissance, the enemy forces were aware of the position of our troops. Oh, I guess I could have done that. <laughs> John. Hey, John, John, what's up? Hey, yeah, product of its time is a good description. I don't know how it will hold up. What's up, John? Long time, how are you? Um, yeah, so I, I, it's hard for me to recommend it, but I would say if you find yourself, you know, seeing it for like five bucks to buy or, or renting it for like a buck or two, then I'd say it's worth it. If, if you're in the mood for like a, a slow build, whoa. Horror story. Oh, that was the other dude, right? That was the guy um, at the sawmill. I think. Cow. I didn't think they were gonna like make the because we were on, we got to chapter sixteen really fast. I was like, oh, the ending's probably only gonna take like thirty minutes. I'm, I'm glad they're kind of pulling this out. Like, not, I wouldn't even be stretching it out. They're just. They're making it interesting, <laughs> like how they're delivering the information to us.
As long as we don't have to sneak around any more of those guys, I guess. person in the corner. Dang. <laughs> what? Yep. We lowered that lever and it, it cut this guy in parts. Oh my god. Yeah, that's the dude from the sawmill. Oh my goodness. Alright, we should be caught up now, right? Or are they going to make us relive the bullet thing? Oh. That's right. I saw it in the last video. Yeah, and I, I, I already rewound it, so this room is, uh... Oh, wait, no. I, I guess I got to play, press... I guess I got to play the tape. All right, here we go. Stand back so we don't get crushed by the fucking ceiling. There we go. So it trapped me in. And now we can walk through. Okay. Shoot. I hear. God, I hear him. Hey, I want to talk. So you're just going to ignore me now. Yeah, because you're him now, dude. You've become Carver. He is here, your shadow. Ah, damn it. Where is he? Alright, uh, we know what to do this time, kinda. Be aware. Where is he? He's over there. Shit. Okay. And wants us to walk right towards him. Shit. Okay. Don't look at him. Don't look at him. Don't look at him.
He's in here, isn't he? Stay down, stay down. Keep your head down. Ooh, man. Fuck the police. <laughs> I'm trying to eat my Hot Pockets in peace. My kid keeps crushing them. I hope the movie is safe and goes well. Uh, uh, the moving goes safe. Yeah, yeah. Um, that's right. I saw that. I think I saw that on your Instagram. Congrats on the move. I know you've probably been wanting to get out of that last place for a while, so uh, I'm glad I'm glad. Definitely. Say Alice? Ellis. Like Alice. I'm like, I'm playing Alan Wake here. I'm just keeping my head down, man. I don't know if I miss things. I don't care at this point. I need a sign. Am I going the right way? I guess so. Only way to go. So glad we got around. Senor fuckface back there. Wait, is this yep, this is where we go. Shit on me. My love. Shut up! Shit, shit, shit. All this without bullet too, like don't look. Oh shit. Don't look where? Just look at the wall, just look at the wall, see. Where do I go? Where do I go? Walking around too. So I gotta cut through that room. Let's, let's watch his pattern for a second. Back that way. Alan Palmer. Whew. Do it! 
my god. Wow. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That <laughs> that made my butthole clench. Hearing her scream in my ear. Oh, come on with this. All right, let's get the phone out because the game likes sending me text messages. You can't look at yourself in the mirror anymore, can you? Uh, no, if that's me, if I'm the monster, the tree monster this whole time, no, I cannot. Oh, come on. Alright. What's that? It says to go in here. Done with the memories yet? Okay. Got something here. Ah, oh, it's a tape. You gotta be kidding me. The corner. Whoa. Get in the corner. Don't look at her. Oh wow. That ended just like the first movie. No, 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 no. Behind you. Come Holy on. shit, I'm controlling my head and it's going. Come on, look at me. Stop! Steve, oh, fuck! Do it! Stop! Ah! Oh my god. Wow, that was a good, that was a good game mechanic there. The witch has amazing cell service. <laughs> So what did Ellis do? Murderer? Yeah, it's, uh, he's revealing more of his past. It looks like he, he did something wrong in the military. He uh, looks like he maybe let a, a squad in and they got killed. Possibly. Um, and then, uh, and then he went to, um, he came back from that and became a, a, a police officer, I guess. And then a few years after he became a police officer, he shot an unarmed kid at a gas station who he thought was reaching for a weapon. So he did that. We still don't know the story of his wife. Uh, I'm guessing something tragic happened there. Jess. Um, and then we lost our dog a little bit ago. Although I tried really hard not to... I mean, I didn't kill the dog, as far as I know. Uh, in the game. I, as far as I know, I didn't kill the dog. But uh, I, I, it died in my arms, that's for sure. But it didn't. I didn't kill it. But we don't know yet. So who knows? He could be a multiple murderer. What the? F so I don't know what to do in situations like that. When it turns red, I'm like, am I not supposed to stare?
want to happen. I didn't want to walk into a room and see someone standing in a corner. I can't figure out. I don't even know how the hell I got to where I, I, I got so dizzy there. I got so dizzy there. Holy cow. So, why didn't the camera guy not follow his own advice? Got himself killed. Holy crap. Uh, not bullet. Two out of ten. Too much dead dog in this game. Yeah, I am into that. Oh, good. It's exactly the thing we didn't want to walk in on. <laughs> oh, look. It's the one thing I didn't want to happen. And they did it. Twice. <laughs> Oh, wow. Alright, it's been 90 minutes. It's time for you to start giving us answers and letting the game end, because... What am I doing? What the fuck? How do you get a sense of, like, anything here? Like, this house is... God, this house is fucked up. Whoa. Such felt. Oh, that man lived here. Maybe for years. Burn it, burn it. Don't don't burn it. Don't burn it. What the fuck? I'll kill you. What? What the F? Do a dead end. Dude. I'm not done with you. This ain't good. Who are we? I know we're possessed by the witch. Die! Who are we killing? Who in the real world are we killing? It's not so scary when you get lost as you're when you're the monster. <laughs> Way to ruin the immersion seat. Can I go down? 
down here now? I think so. Yes. There's the sheriff. These are all the pictures we took uh, that we found too. Place wants me to destroy the house, huh? Basement time. What the hell Dang, just dude. happened? What was that? Dang, man. Hey, Tivia, what's up, dude? What's going on? I'm guessing you're near the end. Uh, we are near the end, I think. I hope. This is it. Because I'm, I'm, I'm done having we're panic attacks here. for one day. Peter. Okay, good. Basement. Peter. Peter, where are you? Wait, we're still thinking we're going to find the little boy? Come on, bro. Ellis, get your head out of your dumb ass. Did he kill them all? Dude, it's gotta be you, man. You gotta be the one. I know how twists work. Fuck. He's not here. What now? You're here. You're him. You've been in this house for years, bro. Do you really Killing think people. It would be that easy, Ellis. That the kid would be waiting here for you. So you could save him and go home a hero. <laughs> no, Ellis. <laughs> you don't get to do that. Where are you, motherfucker? Show yourself! I'm gonna kill you with my bare hands. And after what you've done, I'm gonna enjoy it! <laughs> so am I. Come on, then. What? The key is under the table. I'm waiting on the other side. What? The key to where? Is this over? No more sneaking around, uh, tree men and stuff? Right, the hatch. This is from the third movie. Oh, great. This is where this the girl crawls through this in the third movie. Although this looks a little bigger than the version she crawled through. Uh, she she had a very... Ah, uh, never mind. There it is. There it is. Hey, Tavia. Uh... Please, if you're gonna throw out guesses, please don't, because I, I think I think I saw you. You might know how this game ends, so uh, I think I saw like a video of yours or a post on Twitter um, where you reviewed the game or something. So if you know the ending, please don't throw guesses out in the, in the chat, please. You 
What third movie? The third Blair Witch movie. Um, remember in the third Blair Witch movie? Uh, at the end, the, the girl has to, like, crawl through the, the tunnel to, to escape. Oh, look at this. Dude. Chapter 17, Revelations, man. We're learning about... All the dirty deeds now. No, 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 please, 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 please. God, I'm not gonna hurt you. Shush, shush. No, 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 I'm not gonna hurt you. Oh, we're hiding. Please. What? Please, 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 please. Oh, her eyes! Quiet, quiet. <laughs> Those are the eyes we kept seeing. We did murder somebody. I'm so sorry. Sorry. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? You sick fuck! This is what you get, you fucking piece of shit! <laughs> it's over. It's finally Whoa. over. Shut up! All those well, people, no children, <laughs> I will rip your fucking heart out! You won't get out of it that easily! Free. Free. I won't let you! <laughs> she always wanted you to become... Shut up! <laughs> Ah, oh, dang it. Yep. It's us the whole time, man. Told ya. I know how this universe works. <laughs> oh, no. Bullet. No, bu bullet. Ellis gave into his rage and despair. The cycle continues. Carver was born again. Wow. Despite his injuries, Bullet survived. He was later found wandering outside the Shannon's house. Oh, thank goodness. He's alive. I guess we took good care of him. Jess cut all her ties with Ellis. After learning of his fate, she didn't say a word. Peter's fate remains unknown. Oh, man. So there are multiple endings, huh? We never did make it down to that basement. With no clue to its whereabouts, Sheriff's body was never recovered from the Black Hills Forest. Oh, so the Sheriff's dead too? Tom McKinnon's body was found months later in the Tappy East Creek sawmill, so rotten it was nearly beyond identification. Holy cow. Dang, dude. So all of our teammates, we led them into an area, they got killed, and we hid in some woman's apartment and killed her to keep her quiet so that the guards wouldn't find us in her room. And that's how we survived, I guess, from war. And then we came back to the States and shot a kid at a convenience store. Dang, Ellis, you got some major problems, bro. Tavia, so now that we beat it, <laughs> it's five minutes later. Did you did you play this game? Do you, did you get a different ending or did you just watch a playthrough of it uh, from someone else? Was there a different ending? Because um, if so, we'll definitely have to you know, play this again at some point.